Hi friends, it's Liz here. Thanks so much for joining me today. I have a quick video to share with you. This is my latest haul from BB Craft. I will have links to everything I'm showing you in the description box below. And if you are interested in purchasing something, you can use my discount code as well for 10% uh, off your purchase. So the first thing I wanted to check out is this lovely trim. I had no idea I was going to be this wide and so much gorgeousness. So I'm so happy with how much was sent in that, um, in that pack. Um, the next thing I wanted to check out is these uh, lace trims and I love the color as you can see they come like I guess rolled up individually with the different uh, styles of them and there's actually quite a few here so I'm really loving of course the um, the color that it already has it's a nice soft uh, cotton it feels like fabric and I love that of course I can use these in any of my projects because it's vintagey looking already I'm not sure if I would you know distress it anymore because I already like the way it looks but that's also something that's a possibility for these as well so these are very nice and I'm very happy with them the next thing I ended up ordering are these uh, rings, the binder rings. Now, I didn't know how many there would be, so I'm quite happy about the amount. And also, check out the different sizes. So we go from the tiny little one, which is giving me so many ideas to make like a tiny little journal that is ring bound because I haven't done that before. So I'm really excited about it. I mean, it fits my pinky. That's how small this one is. And then we've got the largest one in the set. So I'm just going to show you both so you can compare the sizes. So you can see just how different um, of sizing it is. So we've got our largest ring, which is like about one and a half inches. And the small one is about like three quarter inches. So you can just see the sizing different. And of course it comes with um, three other sizes as well in between. So I think this is such a great uh, purchase because I'll definitely be using these up. I know that every time I try and, um, you know, get these somewhere else, they're really expensive. So this is nice. And I can probably do a little bit of, um, you know, alcohol inks or something on them to make them look a little bit more vintage. So I'll definitely be trying that. I've been on a kick to get this type of um, ribbon for a while. I think it's a satin ribbon. I love the way it feels. And when you make a bow, I love the way that that, um, that fabric stays. So I'm very happy with that color because I didn't have that already. And I think it'll just be nice again and added touch to something. These ones are gorgeous can you see the little rose in the center so it comes in all these different colors and I think it's just a beautiful little finish it's got gold and it's got the you know the different colors that you see there and there's quite a few in this um, package as well so another one I'm happy with this one is um, a smaller package but still really cute I think these are really nice to have like a little added bling to something I like that they're pearls and they've got like a gold and a silver kind of attachment to them so I think that's really cute and um, yeah there's I mean there's definitely enough to use in a project and I'll be using them just to you know clip onto something with those bulb pins now these ones, I had no idea how small they were going to be, but they're still very cute. These are all butterflies and it's like a fabric. Um, so they feel just really, really light. And you can see it's a very sheer fabric, but you can still see the detail of the butterfly, which is really, really nice. And there are so many in this pack. So I'll have to see how I play with these and use them up. These, I've been wanting to get these stamps for a while. Um, I'm definitely going to be using these in a project very soon. So I'll show you the idea that I was coming up with, but I love that it's the, um, you know, the little playing cards, the queen and the king, and it's got all the little pieces to make it. Now, another uh, item that I selected that I'm quite excited about, I had no idea it was going to be this many. I thought I was just selecting like one design, but it comes with all of these and I think it's doubles of everything. So you've got circles, squares, rectangles, and um, these ones that look like they're maybe windows. And of course, the ones that look like they're a little a lace frame. So I'll open one up just so I can kind of show you 
the different designs that are just in this particular package. You can see the different colors of paper. So it's very, um, it's a light paper. I would say maybe a little bit thicker than photocopy paper or maybe about the same. Um, I love that the colors are like nice and earthy tones and there's just such different designs. So each of them is such a nice different design. You see that you've got two of each pack. And of course, like I said, you've got your squares, your circles, your ovals, and the um, the ones that look like they're little windows or, or gates. And then these ones here. So this is quite a large selection of them. And I really had no idea I was going to be this many. So I'm quite excited to use these up. I will probably need to just add them to a page, like actually glue them on because it wouldn't be good to use them as actual frames because they're so thin but maybe I can come up with something to make them a little bit more um, you know to have a little bit more support if I will be using them as frames and something so we'll see we'll see what I come up with all right so here comes the next thing that I decided to get so I saw this die and I thought it was so interesting because it actually is a die that has um, a little gift card holder. So it comes with a bunch of um, really great pieces to be used. I'll put a photo on the screen here of how it looks on their website. Um, and also I did want to mention if you don't have a metal um, die cutting machine, I have a video showing you some tips and some tricks on how to use metal dies without a machine. And I'll link that video below if you haven't seen it. So I'm really excited about this because I think it would be so perfect to add to journals, uh, like to journal pages. And of course, add that to um, uh, Happy Mail when I send things out as well. Someone can use these up. So I think that's just such a, a nice die and I can't wait to see how it cuts things out. The next die I wanted to try is this uh, dress one. And I like the idea that it has like the skirt, of course, that kind of folds into itself. So it has some pleats and then you've got the different tops that you can use for it. You know, you've got like five different designs for a top, which is really nice. And then of course it's got like a little bow and some additional little pieces that you can add. Again, I'll put a picture on the screen so you can see what it looks like on their website. And of course, you know, however you make it with the papers you use, it will come out so different. Uh, the other thing that I really wanted to check out is this, um, this stamp. Um, because it looks to me like it could be mixed media backgrounds. I really wanted to check this out. This is a way that I'll try and distress some of my, um, uh, projects that I'm working on and I think it'll look end up and end up looking really nice. Now this I was so excited about and very surprised. I wanted this trim and of course when you see it on on the website it doesn't look this big but my gosh look how much there is and look at the gorgeous gorgeous uh, you know design here. I absolutely love it. I'll be using every little bit in many, many projects for sure, because there is a lot and I'll definitely um, cut some up to add some into some snail mail for sure, because there is so much here, my friends. So again, I hope you enjoy my quick haul. Don't forget to use the discount code. I will link everything I've shown you in the description box below. And if you have any questions, comments, let me know. And I will see you very soon with some projects that I made using these pieces that I received. Thanks so much for stopping by.